How cool would it be if we could teach the class right here? I know, right? So yo, set up some chairs. Yo, have how, an outdoor class. how do you feel about an outdoor Elm Summit? I would absolutely love like a retreat. Yeah. My goodness, man. Like, Sign me up right now. So, because I'm thinking, because this is one of the things that some of the volunteers have suggested. Yeah. Like a, like a super low budget, outdoorsy, Absolutely. campy style. I'm all about low budget, camping, rough it. Yeah. Just get some sleeping bags and some tents and... I like California could be one. Oh my, there's tons uh, of amazing places here there's, uh, that would be good for that. There's also uh, Big Bend National Park in Texas, which is the largest national park in the northern uh, U.S. continental uh, landmass. It's beautiful. Yellowstone, man. Oh, Yellowstone. Zion National Park, Utah. Yes. Sequoia, Kings Canyon, John Muir National Forest. You know what? Maybe. Some amazing may places. <sighs> amazing. Yes. And it would be cool if the if, if if the summit itself. Oregon. Is uh, it has a has a theme and focus. Uh, absolutely. You yeah. know, like that would be good to to maximize benefit of our time. It's like uh, like a. I don't know, like a week long thing. Yeah. And this summit, we're only gonna cover Ciro. Yeah. Or we're oh, only gonna amazing. cover uh, the life of a, like a prophet. Or we're only gonna cover a particular, uh, like imagine an entire summit just on Tahara. Hmm. Right? It would be hard to sell. <laughs> I'd do it. Um, uh, but like, or, or a summit on food, but roughing it capture your food and we learn about okay, okay, okay. <laughs> what you're just like you're like no, 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 I, I didn't mean that that much roughing it <laughs> like capture your food slaughter it what skin if it. i can't capture any food do i go hungry <laughs> <laughs> can someone share with me you, 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 i've never gone hunting before so. you, you can join the class of the gatherers okay. hunters <laughs> and gatherers i'll just be vegetarian for the day <laughs> Pick my berries. <laughs> Everyone's going to hunt rabbits. I'll go get some berries. Man. Yeah, <laughs> you join Shaq Muhammad with. I uh... end up picking a poisonous berry. <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. No, but like, what what do you think would be manageable? Like, if we, if we were to do like a, a test run for like a outdoors, I'm thinking like what, 15, 20 people, maybe 30. Yeah, I think I think uh, you know. Yeah. 25 people would be good. Okay. You know. 25, 30 people. I don't know. Uh, you could do bigger than that. Um, but if you do it bigger, then you run into the issue of basic logistics of like bathroom um, and things like well, that. Well, you, you can get a, a campsite, you know, that has like some cabins or some bathroom set up or something like that. There's a lot of places like that that are set up for, for this type of program. I see. So I think it would be a really good opportunity to kind of get away from so many of the distractions and so many of the, so many of the pollutants, you know? Yeah. That, that make it difficult for our hearts to connect to, to Allah, to the Qur'an, yeah. to the personality of Prophet Muhammad وسلم, to one another, Yeah, you know? I think that would be a really, um, a really valuable opportunity. Cool, cool.